Morning guys, I'm making some what I call chocolate fudgy type cookies and I wanted to share it with you and this is the first time I'm making this recipe so hopefully it'll come out good but like I said I don't edit so I have to get this done. I have to get it done now so you can see the result. If I run out of time by chance well then I'll just make another video of myself stuffing my face with these cookies. Yes they're part of my eating plan to lose weight because I will not do without. It's just moderation guys. Moderation, moderation. So here we go. Let's see. In a medium sized bowl mix together the cocoa powder. I will put the recipe below if you want to because these look so good. I hope they come out as good as they look. Um, I'm going to mix the cocoa powder the white sugar, the butter, melted butter. Let's see here guys. I think I might have to throw this in the micro for just a second. Is it, well, no, it's all melted, so what the heck. Okay, so the melted butter. Okay, that goes in there. and the vegetable oil. I use avocado oil because avocado oil is actually good for you. Okay, so mix those together until fully incorporated, darlings. Fully incorporated. Do it slow so that cocoa powder doesn't go all over my face. I hope you can see that. Let's see. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh my god, so chocolate. Okay guys. Look at that chocolate. Mm. Okay, I would say that that is fully incorporated. Okay. Now I've already mixed the flour and salt and baking powder like they said to. So I mix them all together and then put it in. And to avoid any drastic mess, oops, I will mix that in a little bit before I do that. BNA. Kind of a weird... Oh gee, I just noticed I did something wrong. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, I forgot to put in the egg and the vanilla. So what? I'll just put them in. Okay, I've noticed that when you don't follow a recipe completely, like it says separate this, separate that, add this then, add this that. I've done this several times where I just throw it in and mix it all in, and it still comes out perfect. So I'm not sure what that whole thing it is. Add the flour, then add the egg, then add this, then add that. I don't know. I, I've done this before. Well, I'm going to mix it really, really good, guys, since I couldn't really, really, really good. Okay. okay. Yum, yum. <laughs> yes, guys, you were supposed to put in the vanilla and the egg before you put the flour. My mistake. We'll just see how they come out. Okay. Okay, now it says to mix in one third cup, but I put more than that. I like lots of chocolate chips in my stuff. I don't care. That's, that's me. I think I'll get a better spoon than that. Mm, there we go. Fold 
in the chocolate chips, darlings. Yes, sir. Fold it in. I don't think that's enough chocolate chips, to be honest with you. I really, I'm sorry. I need more. I just, I'm sorry. I need more chocolate chips. These are supposed to be fudgy, chewy, right? So in order to do that, I must add more chocolate chips. That's all there is to it. Yep, 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 yep. Can't stand a dirty kitchen counter while I'm working. Isn't that weird? I just, oh, I can't. Anyway, so let's put some more in, guys. Gotta have more chocolate chips, you know? That's just the way it goes. All right. Let's get those mixed in there. Ooh, that looks so good. I wish I could eat it raw, but I'm so afraid to eat raw dough because of the eggs. Well, I just don't want to find out. Oh, guess what? I did get salmonella. Ooh, isn't that fun? Oh, yeah. No, thanks. Okay. One to two tablespoons of dough. I think I'll do two. Yes. Okay. I'm going to switch you around. And I'm going to do one to two table. Or I'm going to do two tablespoons. It says one to two, but let's make them nice size cookies. So there's. Oops. <laughs> okay. There's one. No, 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 chocolate chip. You stay there. You're not going anywhere. Sorry. Now I'm going to do one tablespoon. That's big enough. This is supposed to be something to enjoy, not totally pig out on. And of course, always wash your hands thoroughly before you do any cooking. And Keep your hair back, guys. There's nothing worse. Ooh, let me move this camera. I'm hitting it, which I'm sure you don't appreciate. Um, there's nothing worse than finding a hair in your food, which I have done. I have absolutely done in a restaurant. And wow, is that gross. Ooh, boy, is that gross. Mm. You feel like, oh my god. And technically, if something is baked or cooked with a hair in it, yeah, you're, you're killing off the, hair, the germs, but man, it's the visual. No, 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 no. So I always like to put my hair back. Oh, yes, and this is part of my healthy eating plan. That's right, you heard me right. I am not going to do without completely. I refuse to. And on my weight loss journey... I am losing weight slowly but steadily, but I am also treating myself, okay? I'm not going to do that, guys. Life's too short. I don't care what anybody says. It's just too short, and I do not want to do without, and I'm not going to do without. Mm. Hopefully, guys, these come out all right since I didn't mix the... But like I said, I have done that before. I actually tested a recipe where I um, made two batches where it tells you to separate this, separate that, add this then, add this that, you know, back and forth. And then I threw it all together in another bowl. They came out identical. So I don't know. You know, maybe it does depend on the particular recipe. I don't know. But okay, guys. There's the first batch. We'll see how they come out. Oh, let me rinse my hands. Mm. All right. Let's throw those babies in the oven for, let's see, oh, no, 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 no. 10 to 12 minutes. I'm going to do 12. Yep. Oh, damn it. Oops, sorry guys. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so anyway. Oh, I don't know if you can see me if I'm up here high enough. Hi! 
it's a no makeup, no frills day. And when I cook, I like to have my hair totally and completely back. Oops, I wouldn't want to hit that. Totally and completely back because I can't stand to have hair in the food. So yeah, I put my hair all the way back. And of course, I'm wearing my Elvis. He cooks with me. He goes to bed with me in my bedroom. You know, he's, he's just with me everywhere. <laughs> oh, God. But <clears throat> I even have sets, guys, of Elvis glasses. <laughs> Can you see that? <laughs> these are just my cutesy ones. I have nice sets, but these are my cutesy ones. Elvis Presley. He's my baby. I can't help it. So, well, I guess we'll just wait now and let me get this camera off of here. Hi, Munchkin. Did you come to see what Mama was cooking? Well, I'm so sorry, but I just can't allow you to have chocolate. That's bad for doggies. Yes. Although, I must say, guys, before I knew that chocolate was bad for dogs many, many years ago, I had a dog. Her name was Mistletoe. <laughs> that dog chowed down on chocolate all the time. This was a long time ago. So, let's see here. Oh, let's lay that down. No, you know what? I should have left it. Oh, well. Oh, oh there's that fly swatter. Oh, my God. <laughs> How many of you guys have done that, right? Let's put that away. See these bottles, guys? I used to get my um, purified water from Natural Grocers right near me. I, used, I have been doing this for years and years. Gosh, probably back in 2007 since then. And, of course, when my son lived with me, Nathan, of course, he would carry the bottles in, which was fine. But... Uh, you know, he moved out, what, a little over three years ago. And so I've been lugging these bottles in every day, every time I get them, rather. And I hurt my wrist pretty bad a couple of weeks ago. Or it was just last week, yeah. Uh, I hurt my wrist lifting one. And so my son ran out and got me a, a pure, let's see, this thing here. Ta -da! Oh my gosh, it's so much easier. I was telling him about what happened, and so he... He, he went out and got me one so I don't have to lift bottles anymore. It's so nice to just pour your water in the little thing there and it comes out nice and pure. It tastes exactly the same as, you know, the water I would get from um, the health food store, purified. You know, I'd fill up each bottle. So, yeah. But anyway, let's see. How about I take you out front while we're waiting for those cookies? Hi, baby. Would you like to come out for a moment? Yeah, visit with Mama. So these are... Come on, you can come out. I'm so lucky this dog does not run. So these guys, I am getting... Or I'm growing some morning glories and moonflowers. I'm so excited to see them because morning glories take over. And I'm going to have them crawl up the trellises here and those are just petunias all the flowers have grown but more will come another pot full of <clears throat> morning glories and uh, moon flowers but there's the aren't they pretty petunias and then those are some beautiful they're uh, fall colored daisies they come in yellow red orange kind of brownish I'm excited to see what those are like and then this is just a type of sedum, which puts in a lot of pretty flowers. Are you checking out the little, are you checking them out, baby? Yeah. And then this is just, I threw a bunch of wild seed flowers that I got at Walmart years ago. I just throw the seeds in there, guys, and they come up. Just tons of pretty flowers. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Oh, and then this tree, guys. This tree right here, it's a mimosa tree and it puts out the most beautiful fuzzy pink flowers. Beautiful fuzzy pink flowers. I'll show you one day when they finally come in. Oh, kitty. Oh, kitty. Come on, Pixie. Come on, Pixie. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. 
Oh, 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 what is it? What is it? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Seven more minutes. La, 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 la. Seven more minutes. Oh, guys, I'm going to show you my little, moo baby, my kitchen witch. Isn't she cute? Her name is Cassandra. I named her Cassandra. And she's a kitchen witch. I don't know if you've ever heard of them. But she says, I am a kitchen witch riding my broom. Love and affection I bring to your room. Pots boiling over are a thing of the past. With my kind of magic, good fortune will last. That's my Cassandra. Isn't she cute? <laughs> and this is, I always donate to the Animal Humane locally here every month, just a little bit. And they send me pictures of all the animals. Oops of all the animals that I help, several of them, that I help with my donations. And of course, there's Elvis, what can I say? And magnets that my son and Nathan brought when he was out in Cleveland for a while. Yeah, and then my little sign that I love. Happy days are here again. Yes, sir, yes, sir. And of course, I have my blue moon. Isn't she pretty? You know what? I should have Elvis. Blue Moon. He always sings Blue Moon. So I think I'll put Elvis right there. I just don't like to have a lot on the front of my... I don't like a fridge all covered in magnets and stuff. But, yeah, that's more fitting for him. Yeah. There we go. Let's center that. I've got to have it centered. Put that over there. Get that out of there. Oh. There we go. There's my Elvis. I think he made one called Blue Hawaii, wasn't it? So, yeah, that goes good. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> so, anyway, guys. Just trying to pass the time till I... My cookies are ready. Get my keys out of the way. See my little... My little, um, this table just has my little magical goodies on it. Ganesh, see him? You know who that is. Ganesh and my another Buddha and my little candle inside. Got that from Goodwill. Isn't that cute? It's just a thing. But I put a candle in it and of course it looks beautiful when it glows. It's got such beautiful beaded work. And then, of course, I got my lights. Those turn on. They're beautiful. My Eiffel Tower. Got those at Hobby Lobby, too. And just a little magical box and some rocks and things I found and things that my grandkids, they brought me these. They, they look big on film, but they're teeny little acorns that they got from the mountains for me. Isn't that cute? They're just real. And look at the tiny little pine cones. To show you how tiny they are, <laughs> there's my nail. <laughs> tiny little bitty pine cones. And then, of course, my money frogs. Nice froggy. Nice baby. Bring that money in. Yes, babies. And then my magic pearl. It's actually a real pearl in there, guys. I can't open it without putting the camera down. So, But there's actually a real pearl in there my little magic pearl. Oops, let's put you back where you go. And then my grandson, Skylar, made this cat for me. Isn't that darling? <laughs> so he's part of the animal family up here. And this is musical. Let's see if I can get it to... No. Never know with YouTube. You hear any music and bam, you're banned. So I, it plays music though. But yeah. And there's my... Have you noticed I like Paris? <laughs> I like anything French. <laughs> like I said, it affected me a lot when I went there. It was a place that I'll never forget and I love like crazy. Gotta do those dishes now. Ugh. And see that? I love to put my, I call them fairy lights. Um, in my kitchen. When all the lights are off and only these are on at night. It's just so cozy looking. And my son Josh built this for me, and this is what I hang my towels on. That's it. I just hang them right there, see? Right above the sink, so they're nice and convenient. And of course that 
it's real pretty and that I got from Goodwill and that as well just a little decor and that is a bottle opener which is so cool another um, Goodwill or thrift store I don't remember that one hmm but another thing I like guys is I love a little light let me wipe off this chocolate since I haven't had time to clean it Ugh. but I love a little light in the corner of oh whoops I knocked that over hold on guys Ugh, this chocolate got everywhere um, I love a little light in a kitchen like on the counter because it just gives such a cozy like warm feeling especially at night you come in and you've got this um, nice cozy little you know corner excuse me for all the movement guys but yeah I love that <clears throat> and when I don't have my lights on which it won't do much good to turn that one off maybe that one too you can see it gives just a nice little glow get all this stuff out of the way see there I love it at night and I got this at Goodwill as well <laughs> see it's just a little and this initially had a glass like a floral thing but I broke it and I didn't want to throw it away I thought I can use that one day well of course I did I just put that on top if I can get that on there now that I'm not paying attention there we go oh see guys I want to do this there okay I don't know did you see that god I didn't even pay attention to the camera I got this at Goodwill oh I think the cookies are ready hold on let's get this back up hold on guys I'm gonna put the camera down for a second and you are gonna get straight come heck or high water okay So let me put the camera back in. Oops. Oh, I hate that little stand thing. And let's see what they look like. Oh, <laughs> I'm probably giving you guys vertigo. <laughs> but let's see what they look like. Let's get this out of the way. Okay. Get the lights back on. And let's see what they look like. Oh, those look yummy. They came out just like they said they would. Soft and oh yeah, you can tell those are going to be chewy, chewy cookies. Look at them, guys. Let me get that close. See if I can get that close without the... Can you see that? I don't know. The lighting's not so great right here. But they're very chocolatey. Ow! Damn it! Ooh, sorry. <laughs> I touched the pan with my hand. That hurt! <laughs> Ooh, anyway, let me try that again. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. Nice and chocolatey. Ooh, I can't wait to eat that. That's going to be yummy. I love chocolate, guys. I am a chocoholic, which is just terrible, but I can't help it. It's just the way it goes. Guys, I'm going to get one even though it is way hot. Maybe I'm not. <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> Normally I can handle hot. <laughs> mm. Oh, my God. And those are delicious and it says to let them cool for 10 minutes before you get, pick them up because they will fall apart oh my gosh those are delicious mm. nothing like a fudgy cookie guys <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> that did not feel good on my arm <laughs> i think i'll put some cold water right there luckily it's not bad just a touch there we go. Yeah, it doesn't even hurt now. Okay, guys. So, anyway. Oh. I'm done <laughs> with that batch. I don't know if that's high enough. <laughs> but I will see you guys 
tomorrow maybe or the next I don't know like I said I'm gonna make my videos random as can be I might do one a day I might do four a day I might do one a week four a week I don't know whenever I feel like it <laughs> so we shall see you guys and say bye to Elvis <laughs> take care guys have a good one. I'm going to make myself a cup of coffee and enjoy one of these cookies as part of my part of my yummy yummy plan. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>